good morning guys now we're going to discuss about the differences between acm and intune okay on different feature level activity okay let me give Sorry. you first intune and then acm okay yes now oh. let's go with intune and acm okay so let's try to understand the differences between them both first see where it is positioned so intune is in cloud ccm is on premise what is the cost this is both are subscription based both are subscription based next what how do we do the software patching here how do we do software patching so software patching here is mostly it supports updates then through update rings then cumulative update then security update and we deploy drivers as well so all of it can be done in your intune as deployment whereas here it supports updates but we can choose but we can choose which update to deploy we can choose which update to deploy and the best part is it supports third party update as well it supports third party updates as well okay microsoft in intune it is they are still working on this feature it is not at full fledged but as of now as we speak the third party updates are not yet supported by intune as of now maybe this next by next year first quarter we might be able to see something there okay keep an eye out for it then sql database so in intune there is no sql database whereas in scm yes there is a sql database next console access how is the console access it is done by https colon double slash endpoint.microsoft.com whereas how you, how how you do the console access here you need the you need to install binary from ssm or binary of ssm console on admin machine it means you need to install binary of ssm console on admin machine next infrastructure no servers required for this just a URL access, no server required. You need on premise on premise servers. You need on premise servers. Okay. Required for DP, MP, etc. Image management. Windows 10 autopilot over internet. Windows 10 autopilot over internet. Here you have task sequence. Okay. Over intranet. Next. Application deployment.
cannot deploy more than 8 GB of application. Cannot deploy more than 8 GB. Okay, here can deploy more than 8 GB. Next, operating system supported. Only workstations, both servers and workstations. Reporting very much limited, very much limited reporting. Okay, no, not much of a uh, not, not much of a. Uh, reports that we have in SCCM, but here we have extensive reporting capability. Extensive reporting capability. So these are the very, very clear differences between your SCCM and your Intune. Okay, so if you remember these, then this should give you a very Detail understanding because you will you will be able to validate all of this what I just said at the end of the class. Mm -hmm.